What is up, YouTube? This is Mr. MPQ, your source in the Southwest for all things Marvel Puzzle Quest. Coming to you live this time from Anaheim, California. I'm actually uh, getting ready to go to Disneyland in the morning with my uh, family, my wife, my daughter, and my mother-in-law. So um, I do apologize for not getting a Crash the Titans video out sooner, but um, because of where I was at this week for work, actually out in Pensacola, Florida, and in uh, Mobile, Alabama, and then the travel time, it was just not possible for me to get that video made. Uh, but here we are doing just that. So if you're new to the channel, welcome. Thank you so much for joining us. If you're a regular, welcome back as always. If you like what you see, every like, share, and subscribe is always appreciated. It does help us continue to grow this online community for Marvel Puzzle Quest to reach other questers just like yourself. We are on the uh, march to 500 subscribers, and we're nearly there. So if with your help we can achieve that, I will be giving away a $25 gift card. If we get to that goal by December 31st, 2018, we'll give away $50 worth of gift cards instead. So without further ado, let's get to Deadpool's Daily Quest. In the top right hand corner, you can see that Four Star Cyclops is the required character for this crash cycle. There's a bonus Heroes for Hire package available with Medusa and Four Star Captain Marvel. Very, uh, Both very powerful, good characters. Uh, plus 20,000 purple eyes, so 6 command points, and 16 elite tokens. And then next required character will be Rogue coming up shortly. Alright, so in Deadpool's Daily, you can see I've not done anything for today. I was driving to California from Phoenix. Uh, looks like Hulkbuster is the require, or the uh, chosen opponent. 4 star at 270, red, black, and blue. Uh, of course, red and blue being overlapping colors with Cyclops. Rewards for completion include 22,000 taco points and flashing in the bottom right hand corner a latest Legends Recruit token. I'm going to do a quick look in the taco vault. You'll see Cyclops is also there with Domino. Let's see if we get lucky on maybe a four star pull. Try a couple of tokens here and no such luck. So we're just going to get to it. So Hulkbuster uh, can be very potent and dangerous, but then again, so can Cyclops. Mine's championed at 285. I keep him at a 535 build. <clears throat> Almost 16,000 health. Pretty pretty significant for a 4-star at this level. Combined Forces 10 red AP deals a base damage of 5755 and destroys a chosen basic tile. If you have 10 or more team-up AP, instead deals 12 uh, 1650 and destroys a chosen row not dealing uh, damage or generating AP. Uncanny Strategist at level 3 uh, gives you an additional 3 AP in your strongest color with the uh, match of a team up tile when this ability is on the board uh, 5 AP cost, very cheap and then called shot for 8 blue AP lets loose damaging blast and uh, all uh, red basic strike attack and protect tiles in a 5x5 five five area around it uh, dealing 3319 damage. He is affiliated with heroes and X-Men for all supports, abilities, and events where those make a difference. And Hulkbuster at level 270 has almost 18,000 health, as you would expect from Hulkbuster. His Repulsor Punch is a 9 red AP cost, but the damage varies based on how much AP he actually has. Um, for uh, each red AP, he deals 630 damage, so if he has 10 AP, for example, um, that's 6,300 damage, and it generates obviously much more if he has a higher red count, but the nice thing about AI is it doesn't typically wait to stack AP. Um, Overdrive for 11 black AP is going to deal a small amount of damage, 1533 to Iron Man, but gains 9 red AP in the process, and creates 2 yellow strike tile strength 351 each, that's an extra 700 plus damage per match. And then that fuels just enough to at least fire this once, if not add more to the damage already being dealt. And then Hulk Proof for 9 blue AP is going to create uh, 7 basic green tiles to red and then create 3 blue uh, strength 72 protect tiles, which is um, over 200 protect per match or ability used against him. So we're going to try a clean run. Uh, the thing we need to do is focus on red and blue, obviously keeping that away from... Uh, Hulkbuster 
And I think we're off to a very good start here, so we can start with that red. Okay. Uh, let's do black. And of course, he's getting all those red matches right off the bat. yellow, uh, take the blue, uh, I guess we'll do team up with purple, of course that gives him the red, I didn't want to do that, but hopefully he uses the ability quickly to deal less damage later on. going to set up this ability, which I should have done on the last turn. Of course that went away. Take blue and red. He's going to take that match for blue. Stealing my thunder there. Alright, we are going to deal a ton of damage here. And collect all that red. And then, let's see, if I can get one more team-up match, it's going to give me what I need. Uh, where can I get it from? Let's do... Oh, he's got enough red, so this is going to be bad. Alright, so we're just going to do this. And what can we set up here? I think we can do this. We can do this. And then this. And yes, he's gonna beat me into the ground. Alright, so if we need to use some boosts, we can. I don't think it's necessary. <laughs> so we're just gonna revive, use up some of them health packs. Play a little bit smarter. Uh, take the red. Time. Hmm. Do that. That worked in our favor. Get this. All right. So we are sitting at nine team up. Ugh. Almost, but not quite. So let's do this. Beautiful. Now we have 10 team up AP, we're going to deal 12,000 damage, and that is enough to get the job done. Which is the way we should have done it in the first place. All that for a latest Legends token. Progression rewards, but not the individual node specific rewards. 4 star blade in the process as well. <clears throat> Whoops. So we're going to back out to the main menu, then go to Recruit. We actually have two Latest Legends, one from my daily rewards just before getting Blade as well. So we're going to pull both of those, start off, oh, and I got Cable. Oh, 
five-star cable. Woo, I've been trying for that for a long time. And then Nico Minoru, I'll take that. So um, I'm going to push my luck a little bit with 58 command points. I can make two more pulls. There is a one in seven chance for cable, uh, Kitty Pride, or Loki. We already got one cable. I'm hoping for another. We got Mordo, and we got Miles Morales. Oh, and ooh, four star Ghost Rider. Beautiful. Hey, that is that is a good run right there. So we're able to save Nico's cover. Add a level to Mordo. Add a level to Miles. They're all champions. Add a level to Ghost Rider. Add a level to Blade, because he was in the mix. And then recruit. Oh, wait. Ooh. Recruit Prowler. He was in my Dealy Bobber there. And then recruit Cable. Five star Cable. Just enough. Command, uh, hero points to do that and uh, getting some prowlers from the alliance event so thanks everybody for playing on that so I'm going to do just a quick little gimme here on these extra covers and until next time as always thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to like share subscribe um, post it on social media Twitter uh, reddit you know uh, wherever discord or facebook group you guys might be in and that helps us reach other questers like yourself again to get to that 500 subscriber mark so we can hand out some gift cards and uh, hopefully that's for you so thanks again for watching if you need more marvel puzzle quest in your life um artem john Media, uh mirkoche 17 uh kill power 559 and enios uh four all great for watching extra content um, please check them out show their channels some love as well on twitch and here on youtube and until next time this has been mr mpq your source in the southwest for all things marvel puzzle quest keep on questing and i'll see you in the next video thanks again for watching adios